Life has changed a lot for the Farinac family of Severn. You can be a little shy. Just over a year ago, Amy Farinac wasn't sure if she'd have moments like these again. I can't take your shoes off. I felt a small lump up towards my armpit, and I didn't think anything of it. Would you like some water? But tests revealed... And I was stage three at diagnosis, and had I waited longer, I might be at stage four. Three boys under five a husband, a career, and breast cancer at the age of 34. That probably is still the hardest thing that I have to deal with. I find that I try to take everything and smile no matter what, but when it comes to thinking that this disease could one day take my life and I could leave these little boys without a mother, it's terrifying. Fear quickly turned to action for Amy and her husband, Mike. I couldn't have done this without him. He took up all the roles that I had in the house but kept his own. Amy's breast cancer became theirs to take on. Mike joined her for every treatment and celebrated even the most difficult milestones. And we made a big celebration of me shaving my head. Um, so we had 50 of our closest friends come to the house and my husband Mike shaved my head and I got to shave his head. This outpouring of love inspired Amy to improve the experience for others. During her treatment, Amy launched amystrong.org, a website to help others going through the same thing. And part of that came the boxes of sunshine, a care package with comfort items for those going through chemo. After her final treatment, it was Amy spreading sunshine once again for all of her friends and family to see. Her husband, Mike, and three boys waiting at the finish line, the pink carpet, for perhaps her biggest milestone yet. I want to show my kids that no matter what you're faced with, no matter how tough things are, that you can be strong and you can be, you can smile and you can push through. In Severn, Sarah Caldwell, WBAL TV 11 News.